happy Monday. I hope that you guys had a wonderful weekend. I know that we did partially hanging out with our friends and celebrating Brian's 45th birthday. And the other part of it, we just hung around the house and relaxed and did nothing. Well, he did nothing. I, on the other hand, did stuff. Like I did laundry and cleaned up and Hold on. I did laundry and I cleaned up the house a little bit, swept the floor, mopped my bedroom in here, changed the sheets on the bed, put fresh sheets on the bed, um, got all that stuff done. My back is still tweaked and I don't know, like, oh, I hate when it's tweaked. Hold on again. Okay, so, yes. I mopped my bedroom and did a few things and then I just, we pretty much crashed here on the couch all week for all day yesterday. It was really, really nice though. I love being able to just chillax and not have to worry about getting up and going anywhere or doing anything. So we actually watched a movie yesterday too called Made in America. It's with Tom Cruise and it's based on a true story. I absolutely loved it. Brian liked it too, which is surprising because he's not big on like movies. Um, but that leads me into where I'm going today. I am finally, finally going to go see the movie that I have put off now. This is the third attempt for me to go, so I've put it off twice now. I'm going to go see The Greatest Showman. I knew I wanted to go see that movie when it first came out back in December. But um, with traveling and being sick and um, stuff, I just never went to go see it. And I actually had tickets to go see it. Um, but I canceled those tickets through Fandango because you can do that, which is really, really nice. And um, so I canceled that and then rescheduled it for another time. And purchased tickets for I think it was like last Monday, but um, for some reason I didn't make it either because I was um, it was cold outside and I did not want to go out. It was one, it was the last week or week before. Anyway, nonetheless, I canceled at that time. And then today I'm like, that's it. I'm going. The sun is shining. I feel good. I'm caught up on a few things around here. Um, so I am gonna go. So I'm excited to go see the movie. It doesn't start till 11:30, but I think I'm gonna leave here in just a few minutes and go um, to Kirkland's and. Um, TJ Maxx out there. Oh, and I was going to run into Target really quick too. So that's what I'm going to go do. So I'm going to go ahead and get my shoes on and I'm going to go do that. My back is so freaking tweaked right now though. Ugh, it hurts to walk around. So I'm just kind of like taking a break. Ugh. And the first thing that I did when I got up out of bed this morning is I went straight to the shower and that seemed to work out a lot better for me um, with going straight to the shower from the bed because then I didn't come in here and like sit around and it's 10 after 10 and I'm ready. I'm ready for my day, which is wonderful. Um, I'm actually watching Aaron Brockovich right now on TV. I love Aaron Brockovich, um, that movie. It's so good. And I actually want to say that's so funny. There's like that movie is what it's hard to say like when I saw that movie I was still like in a little shell I kind of still lived um I was married to my first husband um but we were still having some rocky patches and he wasn't he it wasn't like we were fighting all the time or anything like that I was just in a funk I was in a very 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 bad funk and I think maybe some of it probably had to do with postpartum depression because my twins were not even two yet so I I was just in a funk and we had went and seen this movie and her drive her gusto her edginess her like flamboyancy her vivaciousness if those are the right adjectives I'm using for her um, she inspired me I mean because I knew I had that in me and it had just been gone for so long at that point in my life that I just I needed to find that again and honestly that movie is what set me on a whole different path of living and lifestyle. Um, I admired what she did and I'm like, I know, I know that I could do something like that. Taking on my divorce wasn't part of it, but <laughs> um, 
that but she did and that's kind of like a weird it's kind of weird but every time i think of this movie or every time i watch this movie which i absolutely love this movie um it, it just always makes me think of that time in my life and where i was then when i watched this and then where i am now um i put myself in like it's just different it's so weird it's funny how like things or movies or something can completely change you and when you go back and you think about it or you watch it or you see it or you hear it even music it <clears throat> It, it makes you feel like this is where I was then and this is where I am now and that that song or that movie inspired me to do something different um, so yeah I mean there's my little there's my morning little blurb for you <laughs> um, but anyway that's it so I'm gonna go ahead and get get going here and um, I don't you know I have like it's an hour and a half to the movie if I get there by 10 30 I can walk right yeah, I'm good I'm good I just don't want to be like sitting in the movie theater forever so because it's it's not gonna be crowded at all so i'm not even worried about that but uh yeah so let's go okie dokie so i am about two minutes away from the movie theater um it's 11 o'clock i went into michael's really quick and i went into target i went into michael's because i wanted to see like what they had as far as valentine's stuff to offer and they had nothing and um i walked i did get a, i did pick up a couple of things though at uh, michael's and i'll show you guys that a little bit later and then um i did run into target really quick to see if they had um i need two more wreaths for for my shutters in the dining room and I found one but they did not have another one so I did get that one anyway so I'll put that one like on the door in the kitchen and then I did pick up two other wreaths that I'm not like they're not like my favorites but they'll do um, for now uh, so and they were only nine dollars so I'm like yeah I can do these for nine dollars not a big deal um, but other than that, that was about it. And I, and I picked up a cute sweater at Target. So I'll show you guys that a little bit later. I am now headed into um, the movie theater to see my movie. I'm so excited. It's so nice just to be able to sit because I, I was about ready to collapse in there at the Target because of my back hurting so bad. Uh, so just so nice to stay off of my feet when my back hurts. But even though they say walking is best for your back. I don't think whoever said that knew what back pain really is because it hurts like a mofo it hurts like a mofo oh they are building so much out here it's like wow they're supposed to be building a varsity out here not that i'm a huge fan of varsity oh look taco bell there's a taco bell out here what the frack that's new a taco bell right next to a mexican grill that's funny <coughs> and Moe's man they have really grown this place up it's amazing oh this place is a little bit more crowded than I thought it was gonna be what other movies are playing right now I wonder if my movie theater is gonna be empty holy crap huh well we shall see hmm. oh my goodness you guys that movie was phenomenal and when they sing this is the greatest show i will have to say it is the greatest show i loved it i loved every single minute of it from the beginning to the end it was amazing i highly highly suggest you go see it i cannot wait until it is out on um blu-ray because i will be buying that movie it is definitely one of my new favorites. If you love musicals, I suggest you go see it. So now I'm on my way home. Okay, so I am back. And um, before I went to the movie, I stopped off at Michael's and Target really quick because I was still looking for some Valentine's stuff. So I told you guys that I would show you guys what I bought. So I'm going to. Um, these are the two little wreaths that I found. They're just like yarn wrapped around a heart. Um, I don't know, it might grow on me. I'm not really sure how I'm gonna like it, but that's where these are probably gonna hang right there. So that's kind of, Brian still has to fix that, but that's where these are gonna hang um, when I get that done. And then, so I picked up two of these and these were $9. So I thought that was 
a pretty good price for those. And then I picked up this one and I thought that I would go ahead and hang this one. I was hoping for two of those because I would have preferred these two to be hanging on my um, shutters. But anyway, so that's where that one's going to hang. And then um, I picked up uh, this sweater at Target. This is a cute little sweater. It's like really light. Uh, and I love the sides. This is what I liked about it the most. I'll get it figured out for you guys. Um, I like the sides. Look how cute the sides of this are. Um, and it's gonna kind of kind of got like a bell sleeve on it. Um, I love it. It's really, really light too, so it's not too heavy. And then I picked up some Myers um dishwashing soap. And I picked up some more conditioner and I picked up some more of my downy infusions because I love that stuff. And then I picked up these cute little puppies. How cute are these little guys for hanging out around Valentine's Day? Look at this one's got spots and the spots are hearts. So I thought these guys would be so cute added to my Valentine's collection. Uh, and then this little um, garland that I picked up as well. That's cute. And then, well, no, that was at Michael's. My bad. So at Michael's I got this. At Michael's, I picked up these stickers, and then I picked up this washi tape from Michael's as well, and that, my friends, is all I got. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. I know that it was nothing exciting. Um, I went and saw a movie, and I absolutely love that movie. Really, really good movie. I was so happy that I went and finally saw it. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching, supporting, subscribing, commenting. Um, I love you guys uh, so much. If it wasn't for you guys, you know, I wouldn't be like doing this every day, but it's because of you guys, I come back every day and I wanna share things with you guys. So thank you so much for doing that. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time in Wonderland, bye.